Thank you for joining us here on Cron 4 News at Noon. I'm Justine Waldman. Our top story today is that an innocent driver is dead after suspects trying to get away from police went the wrong way on Highway 580 right near the Bay Bridge. That decision led to a three-car crash. Cron 4's Charles Clifford joins us now live near the Bay Bridge Toll Plaza with details on what happened here. Thanks for joining us. Well, good afternoon. The scene here near the Bay Bridge has been cleared, but we are learning new details about what happened in the moments before this fatal crash. We've also received surveillance video that shows how this all began. 4.22 a.m., a dramatic scene as this white pickup truck smashes into the front of a tobacco outlet store in El Cerrito. Two men dressed in black start rummaging around inside the store. The owner, at home asleep, receives a security alarm alert and calls 911. El Cerrito Police Department officers arriving on scene find the truck and its two occupants fleeing the area. They pursue along westbound 80 until the truck changes direction and starts driving eastbound in the westbound lanes of 580 near the Bay Bridge. Moments later, the truck smashes into two other vehicles, a white utility van and a gray BMW. According to the California Highway Patrol, the two occupants of the truck and the driver of the van all suffered major injuries. The driver of the BMW died at the scene. Back at the tobacco shop, the front of the building is smashed in. The owner says this is the sixth time they have been robbed in recent years. He believes the suspects stole cigarettes, a large box of which was found at the crash scene. Its contents spread across the roadway. He also estimates that the store might be a total loss, and he's not sure if they'll be able to reopen. I mean, this could be about $50,000 in damage, so you know, I don't know if we can even afford to, 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 to fix that. As of midday Tuesday, the identities of the suspects and the victims have not been made public. All right, back live now. At this point, it's also not clear what, if any, charges the two suspects could be facing. But for now, in the East Bay, Charles Clifford, Cron 4 News.